Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Now, recently I made a video with this board here and I listed some tools I'd eventually like in my very low budget workshop and some projects I'd like to make. I've managed to make two of the tools out of wood I had lying around and some spare construction lumber, but now I've reached a point where I need money to get some better tools to make some better things that I can sell to buy better tools to make better things to sell. But, problem is, I need the money to buy the tools to make the things to sell, to raise the money to buy the tools so that I can make things to sell. It's a bit of a tricky situation. So I did some Googling and there's loads and loads of videos out there of guys claiming that you can make hundreds of dollars baking, making basic products out of two by fours, one by threes, just your basic construction lumber. And I thought, I like this idea, but do they really sell? So I got myself down to my local big box store and bought some construction lumber and I'm going to make four of the most common things I see on YouTube videos and other places for sort of quick selling things. And I'm going to attempt to sell them by various means and see if I can raise up enough money to get some better tools. Stick around to the end of the video to see the four products that I make. Uh, and please, if you like this content, like it, subscribe and help my small woodworking channel grow. But enough of that, roll the build montage. So I know I'm predominantly a hand tool guy, but one of the things I'm trying to make for this craft show uh, has a lot of repeated angles cut on it, and it would just take me way too long to do that by hand and then finesse them all with the hand lean. So I've borrowed my neighbor's miter saw, um, and I think that's gonna make this a little bit quicker and a little bit easier for this challenge. Let's go. There we have it then, four items made out of cheap, affordable construction lumber. So we've got a mobile phone stand. Um, this can also be taken apart into two pieces so you could flat pack it and send it in an envelope nice and cheaply. A milking stool or three-legged stool. Paul Sellers has an excellent video on how to make these. Um, and I've seen a lot of people using them as like planter stands and things like that. So hopefully those are gonna sell quite well. Third, we have this uh, this bottle opener that I've just made out of pallet woods. It's designed to look rustic and a bit naff. I think I could have done a better job on it, but it's definitely got that sort of rustic feel um, and farmhouse aesthetic, which is fine. And then finally, just out of a one by three, we have got a wine bottle stand. These are the four products. Um, I guess let's see how they sell. Are they the best? No. Could I have made better? Possibly. The whole point of this challenge was to make some of the regular things that people claim you can make hundreds of dollars out of by simple things like a one by two, a one by three, sorry, and a two by four. Moving forwards, I'm gonna stick these onto Facebook Marketplace and Etsy, uh, and then I'm also gonna hit up a craft fair as well. So please like and subscribe and stick around to see part two, to see how the sale of these gets on. Um, thank you so much for watching, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video.